Arriving home from a basketball game, Arnold Shotman and his best friend Gerald Johansson learned that Future Tech Industries FTI CEO Alphonse Perrier do won SCH. Tech has announced plans to redevelop the entire neighborhood as a luxurious high-rise shopping mall. That night, Helga Pateki finds that her father, Big Bob, is working with FTI to build a new Super S. Ice branch of his beeper store in the proposed mall. She ultimately sides with her father, though is hesitant to do so because of her love for Arnold. Arnold hosts a demonstration against FTI, but I. T fails when their permit is stolen by Sheck's employees and Arnold's grandmother Gertie Shotman is arrested, causing the neighbors to lose hope and sell their homes to FTI. Just as the fate of the neighborhood appears to be sealed. Grandpa Phil tells Arnold the story of the tomato incident, a major revolutionary war battle fought in the city. Arnold realizes that the neighborhood had to have been declared a historic district after the war, effectively ensuring its preservation. Arnold and Gerald search throughout the city for the legal documents certifying its landmark status and ultimate. Lai discover that the document was sold to Sheik, who denies obtaining the document. As the deadline draws near, Arnold gets a mysterious phone call from Deep Voice, a Deep Throat-esque character, who informs Arnold that Sheik actually has the document inside his office safe, and is lying that he does not know its whereabouts. Arnold and Gerald steal the key to the safe from Sheik's assistant, Nick Vermicelli. Nick later notices the missing key, and informs Sheik. Meanwhile, Phil and the boarders try to devise a backup plan to stop the bulldozers from destroying the neighborhood in case Arnold's plan fails. The plan is to wire the storm drain tunnels beneath their street with dynamite to intercept FTI's construction equipment. Big Bob later teams up with them after discovering Nick. S contract states Sheik will control 51% of his company and swindle him as a result. With help from agent Bridget, Arnold and Gerald infiltrate the FTI headquarters, only for them to discover that Sheik has the document in his hand. Sheik then tells his own family's story regarding the tomato incident. His ancestor, the governor of the local British forces, was defeated and humiliated by Thay. American colonists including Arnold's ancestors during the tomato incident. To avenge his family's honor, Sheik intends to demolish the neighborhood and replace it with a building carrying his name on it. He destroys the document to ensure that his plans will proceed, before summoning his guards to get rid of Arnold and Gerald. They escape, but believe they have failed, until, deep voice, advice. S. Arnold to obtain the FTI's security camera footage of Sheik burning the document. Arnold discovers that, Deep Voice, is Helga, who reluctantly admits she loves him and that this was her reason for getting involved. He and Helga escape the building, and meet Gerald on a city bus, convincing the driver Murray to race home when realizing that his girlfriend Mona lives in the same neighborhood. Despite several near collisions, the kids eventually make it back unharmed. Mia Dixie arrives at the scene, along with the police and a news crew. Accessing the large Sheik Vision Jumbatron poised atop a nearby building. Arnold and Bridget show everyone the footage of Sheik burning the document. Dixie officially restores the neighborhood's status as a historic site, never to be destroyed by anyone for any purpose. Sheik arrives. Demanding to know why demolition has not begun. He sees the footage of himself burning the document on the monitor, and realizes he is caught and facing prison time. Having escaped prison, Gertie sabotages his car, and Sheik is promptly arrested. Harold inadvertently sits down on the detonator that ignites Phil's explosives, causing the Jumbatron monitor to be destroyed. Helga denies loving Arnold claiming her confession was made in the heat of the moment. While Arnold is unconvinced, he pretends to accept it as she returns home.